It's Sam again. Um, we had our last session tonight, so I know some of you um, weren't able to come, and then there were a couple structures that Kelly and I had forgotten to go over, and then there were a couple structures that we wanted to make some clarification on after we went and verified in our notes again. Um, first thing we're going to clarify on are the testicles and the penis again. Um, so, Kelly, I'm going to have you come in. So I'm going to show you this picture that was very helpful. I'll try to put this online. So the first things first is the penis. And we talked about how the pampiniform plexus right here, which is the pink part that goes into this red, will attach to where the head of the epididymis is. If you follow it down, going this way, the blue part is your tail of the epididymis. The part that's on the tail going towards the body of the animal, this green part is your ligament of the tail of the epididymis, and then on the other side from the tail to the proper to the testicle itself is called the proper ligament of the testicle. So I just wanted to show that again on the actual animal here. So I'm gonna have Kelly scroll in. So this here in my fingers are the pampiniform plexus, and right below it is the head of the epididymis. If you follow him down on this side, this is the body and then this is your tail of the epididymis. If I were to grab this part right here that I'm pointing to, that's the ligament of the tail of the epididymis. It's the one going, as I said, back to the animal, the body of the animal, and attached to the tail. Whereas this little part here is called the proper ligament of the tail of the epididymis. It attaches to the testicle and to the tail of the epididymis. So I just kind of wanted to point that out again. The other thing that I know got people a little confused on, and I'm going to have to make some clarification again now that I can show you guys some pictures after we looked in our notes, in terms of the prepucial orifice and the prepucial ring. So as you guys can see this picture, we told some of the group last time that it was the opposite of about what I'm gonna tell you. So I'm gonna tell you guys the correct way. So the one, prepucial fold that is closest to the body on the penis that's in purple. That is called the prepucial ring, not the orifice. So that's prepucial ring. And then this part right here that's closest to the actual glands, that's the prepucial orifice. So ring is most inner portion, orifice is outer. So that's right there. So to show you on the actual animal again so you guys don't get confused, this part here, the most outer portion, is the prepucial orifice. So outer orifice. This part here that's the muscular portion, that's the prepucial ring. So as Kelly said, you put a ring on it, so that's gonna be more inner. And so it's so a ring and orifice. tighter. And it's tighter, tighter too. So prepucial ring close to the body, prepucial orifice. Okay, so I just want to make those clarifications with you guys. Cool.